I'm proud to introduce you here uh, this uh, fourth phase for Autonomous Networks Hyperloops, in short, Blue Thunder. Autonomous Network Hyperloops Phase uh, 4 is a new step in the definition of a global autonomous network and services architecture. It will introduce new standards for real interoperability for critical operations contexts. This new step will demonstrate how mission critical industries and activities can be enabled through a new format of remote control center based on a full autonomous operational framework. This is a VCC concept. This concept is a remote command center completely virtualized acting on top of um, an AN infrastructure. This VCC enables quick, precise, fully operational and highly efficient, resilient operations in very critical, complex situations when speed are key and human life is at risk, where today's solutions may be impossible or very expensive. It also introduces risk prediction with AI uh, real-time analyzers to detect and improve all the another engines. Architecture will use top-edge uh, technology to develop these new capabilities. Of course, an AI infrastructure on cloud, MEC, 5 GSA, slicing to set up the zero X networks. Digital twins platforms to map uh, the, physical con the physical context and the reality to modelize all the worlds. A metaverse visualizer to allow uh, a real operating action in a safe mode remotely. And a real time AI analytics uh, and prediction engine to build and run all the business operation services intent to automate the actions. Many, many cases are possible, and we have designed three to illustrate this. First is a disaster handling virtual command center. Second, a mission critical industry command center, for instance, nuclear or chemical environment. And the last one is about a sustainable, resilient data center command center where we want to optimize the conception of energy through APN networks. We also walk through the last uh, three uh, phases we have developed um, uh, the last times uh, in education, farming, uh, tourism and sports to create an agnostic architecture that will allow every kind of uh, domain to be, uh, to be optimized. For 2023 in DTA, uh, we will present the ambition of this architecture and the DTW in September will design and develop the global architecture with these three use cases. We are convinced that the market is huge uh, through the needs of autonomy and resilience in many domains. Um, ANHL VCC is the augmented operation enabler. We use a lot of TMF API standards, as well as we will define new ones for these interoperable, interoperable operations. ENHL phase four is a foundation of this new framework. Champions and partners for these steps are Entity and Orange, the two founders, Changhua, Team and Verizon for the business vision, Beyond Now, Future Way and Ubicube for the expertise and the design of the architecture, foundation and details. And please feel free to stop at the kiosk C3 and let's engage for a further discussion and understand our use case.